Uh, hey, that's not my team. <laughs> I think it just picks the ones that you were champions with. Perhaps. Anyway, it's time for some more. Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. Um, <laughs> I've taken some time to update my Pokedex. And so at this point, uh, we are at 205 out of 207. <laughs> um, total of 210, uh, which would be these three after the 207. So I'll have to play my other version of the game to get the other one. Uh, and then we got to catch these guys, which we're going to work on these uh, for the most part. And then we have the two new Ridgies, which again, we'll have to, <clears throat> I'll have to play the other one and trade, but you, aren't, you can only get one. And, and then there's the other forms of the legendary birds that I have to get. Because currently I just have the normal. I've also traded over some shinies as well. Um, I think. Yeah, we got the <laughs> my shiny bats. <clears throat> the the one that I've come across the second most shiny, after like Pelipper. Um, and then I have my shiny Metagross, shiny Beldum. I don't know. It's it's good. Shiny Aerodactyl. Uh, shiny Gibble. <laughs> and then, uh, oh god, where's the one that I'm like super proud of? Because it's like a super random way to get it, uh, but when I got it, I got it shiny. <clears throat> so I got my shiny spear tomb, uh, which we'll try to get that one too, because apparently there's a way to get this as well. So, yeah. Anyway, um, I didn't add too many, too many other shinies other than that, I think. Yeah, I got all these guys in here. Okay, let's just go. And I've, and I've decided that I'm just going to pick up the, uh, the footsteps, but we're going to wait until after we finish other stuff. I don't think I'm going to make anything out of those. Uh, let's go here, actually. <clears throat> I want to talk to this lady. Two hundred seven and two hundred five. You're getting so close to completing the Count Tundra Pokedex. So close. Ah. It'll be like a couple days before I probably actually get it done. Also, I've learned that the uh, Pokemon, the legendary Pokemon you can catch in there, it's like a one time only thing. Otherwise, it's just farming for items. <clears throat> Which is kind of a bummer. But I guess that's how they get to release a game and then also keep them rare. A sunny, snowy day. Which I like that. That's much nicer weather.
English. I just want to take a look. Uh, cloudy, cloudy. No fog, though. Which I greatly appreciate. It'll make finding and seeing things a lot easier. Yep, I don't need to catch Pokemon anymore. <laughs> oh, and I've also... I've also transferred over basically every single Pokemon that you can have is in here. I've got all the Ultra Beasts and then the Boy Pole. I've got all my legendaries. Like, these are even shinies. Oh. Wait, do I have two of them in... Uh, I do. I have the... Oh, I forgot to get rid of the... <coughs> I, don't... I forgot to get rid of the extras. Because I have these guys in here, which are the shiny ones. I got my bacon bird. All them. Also have like the thunderous and landerous and all that sort of shit. Anyway. So apparently we have to get to the to the spot up here. That's where we're that's where we're heading, sort of. But I think before we do that, we're actually going to do this again. So, it says, let ring the piercing note that will wake the giant of steel. Apparently, this sets a whistle. I couldn't figure it out yesterday. I don't know why. Apparently you can shiny hunt these guys, too. I like this music. Anyway, and then if you want to fight them again, just light up the lights again. Fight him. I think I'm going to do that on my own time. Uh, but for now, we're going to move on.
I'm just gonna leave that gate open. Oh, I think that's an Agron. <coughs> but I'm not gonna go after it. I just wanted the points, really. I just wanted the points, really. Oh, I ended up back in the village again. <laughs> Not where I wanted to go. Here, we'll ride the bike. Hi, my little girl. Aria. <coughs> and this is apparently special to the Reggie Quest 2. <coughs> this is where you get the last one. to do that. That's why we'll make short work of this cotton bird. Could use those Reggies as uh, farming points for experience too. Who are you? <coughs> What's today's highlight? Set of five green apricorns. Yeah, sure. Got everything else. I kind of want more dust balls. Yeah, it's worth it. I'll make those 10,000 watts back easy.
Ooh, wild Absol. Absol would be a cool shiny. Let's actually get off the bike. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Whatever, we'll see what we caught. It's a magic card. Kill it. <clears throat> what level is it? <clears throat> 62. That's what I meant to do. Oh, I think this is where you could get the uh, the icy uh, carrot. The king brought abundance to light and life to this land that was once a frozen t tundra. We owe these very crown plains to our king. As long as the bond between us people and the king hold strong, these lands will no doubt thrive for all time in fertile green. <clears throat> thrive in fertile green. Is there a crossroads here? What's going on? Uh, uh. Over this way. Well, a large one. him so much. Let's let's fight him. <clears throat> he is one of my favorite Pokemon. I love him. He's a fucking beast. Absol.
we fight the Absol? No, I don't really want to. Uh, it's... Oh, shit. <laughs> Let's fight the Absol. <clears throat> it's the rare marker. We'll see. I still haven't ever gotten lucky and had uh, a shiny raid den. Besides, the extra battle won't hurt me. He looks happy. <laughs> It's a happier Absol than we've ever seen. We got a Tyrantrum? That's cool. I'm sorry, Clefairy. Kick his ass. Team. Oh, second level shield. Which I will thankfully be able to take out with my first turn. Not too bad. Yeah, he's so happy looking. Why? <laughs> Wait, was that Peony? Oh, yeah, it's his daughter. Uh, we're not gonna catch it. Now we can continue. I'll fight the I'll fight the dens if they've got the beam. If they don't got the beam, I don't go in. Wait, I thought that was a shuckle for a second. I'm like, why? Why shuckle? I still think that that is such a cute Pokemon. Adorable. And its evolution is super pretty.
Let's see. Walk together with a living crystal of snow. This one is a lot easier. Look at that little shiny boy. Also, these guys being in here is cool. Mag Mortar and Electrofire. <laughs> oh, there he is. That's interesting. Getting on my bike was enough to put me inside the spawn or the, the transport zone. Yeah, Auroras and Amora. Cute and pretty. Look at that beastie boy. I'm amazed that he's only level 71. Like, I would have imagined that he was level 100 for whatever reason. And we have, like, the, the goofy middle one. <laughs> Just in its regular non-shiny form. Why is, it named, why is it named Crobat? Oh, I think I was going to make it a Crobat. Oh, and then we have the Relicants. Which, I thought that there was a difference between them, male and female. Oh, there is. It's the mouth plate on the side. And Dragonite. Yeah, I've already got my Reggies. But I do need to actually catch the ones in here. Fight it, we'll see what happens. Uh, yes, I want to check it out. Ducky! I love the sounds that these guys make in the, uh, in the shows, in the movies or whatever. Not shiny, he dies. We'll come back for him another time. Although, I'm gonna wanna get the. Uh, I might not be able to spend a lot of time shiny hunting those guys. Maybe I catch them, and then I use the other game to shiny hunt them. Oh, but I can't, because I need to catch them to get the other... Oh, that's lame. I'm gonna have to catch them. I'll probably spend, like sometime trying to get them to spawn shiny, but then just catch them. That is interesting to see them run like that. Two seconds.
knew that if I <clears throat> if I didn't pause the thing, I was gonna get caught in a battle with that bear tick. And why are there no sparkly bits about those tree roots? <laughs> no, it was just frozen. <laughs> Alright, what's over here? Also, I'm noticing that there aren't any footprints up here. There better be something good over here. Project pack, okay. We'll fight him. <clears throat> Uh, too bad you're not shiny. <laughs> well, these big guys are gonna help me level up. Those last couple levels before 100 are terrible. Awful. Torturous, even. Alright, no option but up. You know what? Let's fight this one. <clears throat> She's pretty and we're gonna kill her. Oh, I like that. Three of them level 99. Where's this light coming? Oh, it's not light. It's dirt. Seems like the right place to find, uh, dragons and bats. Wait a tick. What's that over there? Yeah, 
Yeah, how did you get that? There must be another entrance to this cave. Where it is, I don't fucking know. That's a cool view. I like that. Hit Frost Lass. Could be in here, though. These big mouth boys. You know, this is actually the the right way to do Golbat and Zubat and all that shit because. Like, you actually see them all over the place. It makes sense. Still don't know where we're supposed to get to that other secret, though. This could be it, though. They're heavy duty boots. Here we go. They saved it till the end. Oh, Salamence. I almost thought he was an eye. <laughs> We're gonna fight this element uh, on our way back here. Oh, Magmarizer. <coughs> Excuse me. This is not what I was expecting.
Wait, there was another path. Where was it? I think it's on the other side of the settlement. Never mind. Spin! <laughs> You're going down, Dragon Man. Feed my Pokemon there. Oh, this is it. I guess spatially in my mind, I didn't imagine that that would be where it was. It like it didn't it didn't seem right. That's fine. At least I found it. That's all that matters. I don't have to stress out about it anymore. Not that I was stressed. I just don't like not being able to find little secrets. All right up here. have to be nearing the top soon. Bears are a good sign. Huh, that's cool. A whole bunch of frost moths. Rust Moths and Snom. I think they were hard for me to find originally. I don't remember, but like, they're just in a wild abundance here. Mountain, back, mountain bike down that thing, yeah? Shrine. Let's do a save, boy. Oh, it's a Gigantamax Gengar. I'll fight it. Uh, 
<clears throat> so fucking loud. Always so fucking loud. I think that's Peonies, uh, Peonia again. Because I see that Tyrantrum. Yeah, it totally is. song? Oh, shit. That's fine. I think this thing's gonna die this turn anyway. You're just a four star. But you can get Amorite through these guys too. Interesting. Gnarly trees. See what's in here. Oh, a King's Rock. Interesting place this. Seems to be some sort of basket. Oh, it's a stable. I have been waiting, human child. The Crown Shrine is a place I once called home. Victor must think me helpless now that I have lost my powers. It taunts me by making this place its own dwelling. Ah, I see you have indeed brought me the reins of unity. You have my thanks, child. Ah, the feeling of holding these again. The color, the way they shine in the light. Oh, how this brings back memories. Spectreer is a very proud Pokemon. One might even call it arrogant. It will not accept me as its master again unless I'm able to prove that my power outweighs its own. I will use the reins of unity to pour my power into the very body of my loyal steed. That should convince it that I am indeed still deserving of its loyalty. Now, human child, in order to lure my loyal steed to me, 
Place the shade root carrot into the basket near where Spectrier's bed made its bed. Yep. The time has come, human child. But you have successfully defeated my loyal steed once already. It will not willingly approach anyone it considers to be a threat. We must hide and wait for it to appear. Let's go behind this convenient hidey spot. I like the sound of its footsteps. It looks so goofy with its legs. <laughs> I love it. What in the world? That's a huge noggin. And it's got a ride. Oh, I can talk? What? What'd you want? Huh? I got no idea what you're saying. Somehow it also makes sense. Hold the phone. What in the world? Oh, not again. <laughs> Human child. Thanks to your efforts, I have been reunited with my loyal steed. And now I am finally at my full power. I was convinced that the people no longer believed in me, and I had lo also lost my loyal steed. I was trapped in the throes of deep loneliness. But you saved me. There are truly no words to which to fully express my gratitude to you. So I have a suggestion. If you are able to catch me, even with my powers restored, it will prove your worth beyond any doubt, and I will lend you my strength in this journey. Once you have readied yourself, come face me. But at first, I should get this man back to where I found him. It would be no good to let him freeze out in this frigid climb. <laughs> Bye. Alright, now I gotta fight him. Alright, I'm good to go. Around. Want to ready your Pokeballs in order to catch Calyrex? Yes. I think this is going to go pretty quickly. But I don't want to kill it immediately. Also, this is a cool song. Shh. 
shit. That was not my intention. I believe I did that. Well, I'm curious now. If that didn't kill it, I'll try this. That's instant death. As one. That's what I was hoping for. Could just use a Master Ball on it, but I think I'm going to save him. Let's see who else we can bring in here. He's got the Rocky Helmet, which would allow him to do damage to Calrex if he attacks me. So...
Oh my god. <laughs> there we go. Galrex's data was added. Uh, Shadow Rider. It is said that Calrex and, and the Pokemon that had bonded with it ran all across Galar region to bring green to the wastelands. Into a box. Human child. No, I shall refer you to you by your name now. Danny. <clears throat> I look forward to what adventures we might have together. Hello, oh, that you, Chief? It's me, Petey. I just had a dream about big-headed Pokemon talking on and on in a weird shrine. You were there too, Chief. It all felt so real. I got worried about you and decided I'd better give you a call and check in. You haven't hurt yourself, have you, Chief? Not a bunch of tr in a tr bunch of trouble, are you? Everything's under control. Ah, good to hear. Guess I got nothing to worry about then. Yeah. <laughs> The Peony Exploration Team is all about safety and well-being of its members, after all. So, you be careful on your way back, too, you hear? No expedition's over until you're safe and sound back at home base. Alright, jotted down the clues, the status. Calyrex, the King of Bountiful Harvest, was able to reconnect with its loyal steed using the reins of unity. Calyrex also seems to have regained its trust in humankind. As thanks for helping it regain its power, Calyrex is allowing me to take it along on my adventure. Better report back. Wait, does he not have a, a held item? Okay. Can you unfuse them? That's my question right now. There we go. Yeah, now we have them two separately. I can tell that my other game is going to be reset like multiple times because <laughs> I need, I need that, I need a Kung Fu 
And I'm going to need another Spectreer, another Calrex to form the pair. And then I'm going to need two of the Ice Horse and then another one of Calrex. <laughs> The nice thing is, is that at least you can at least you can still go into there with, like, the beginning Pokemon, I think. Anyway. <clears throat> now that we've done that. Go back to base camp. Boy, Chief, how goes the adventure? Anything to report? Uh, Legend of the King of Bountiful Harvests. Calyrex. Wait, you've really caught Calyrex from the legends? That's all should make a brilliant report away. That, that, that knockin's massive. I, is that the King of Bountiful Harvest? The one calling the shots around here? Huh, I could swear I've seen it before. Or then again, maybe not. Anyway, it's definitely regal of it to have a steed. And that massive head does sort of resemble a crown. It's kingly enough, at any rate. Let's just call this a successful expedition. Looks like you've reported all there is to report on Legendary Clue 1 and the King of Bountiful Harvest. Smash it. I'll mark this exploration done. Got anything else? Uh... Okay, we're actually going to call it here. Um, it's a short little guy today. <laughs> Either way, thanks for watching. Have a good one. Bye-bye. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. <laughs>